All right, so I just I just put those rubber washers and everything with a little bit of silicone around everything. All right. So now I mean, we could leave those little plastic washers on, or those little ones on there now. So there's little, these little things. We could leave them on there. See this one? I didn't even look. Look how dirty it is. I mean, it crap like that, water's going to get in there. Let me take one of these off of here. And put it up here, just in case. I don't know. I didn't know those were plastic washers that I got. But, uh... That sucks. That would have been perfect. But I think these are better, these bushings. Yeah, let me take one off here. These things are such junk. You would think Toyota would be. Alright, so take that one off. And I'll put it up here because this is where the problem is. But I think those rubber bushings might work. So let me try plugging it in and see what happens. Squirt a little bit more here because this is this that's the problem. A little bit of silicone ain't gonna hurt. I'm gonna squeeze a little bit more in the hole so when it plugs in, it clog it plugs it. Let's try this. Hopefully it fits. Oh yeah, I think, so. I think that's gonna be good. Yeah, 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 That's tight. That's good. I think. I think it's good. Well, this one's going to get held in with the bolt also. I don't know if they plugged all the way in now. That's the thing. Those washer, those rubber things they put in were a little bit higher. I don't know if they got all the way in. Yeah, this one seems like it's not clicking in. Alright. 
I might have to take two of these out. These middle ones didn't seem like they were plugging in, so let's take them out. Just put silicone in there and use the ones that were there. I mean, I just wanted that front one to be secure. I'm going to leave I'm going to leave the rubber bushing up here and then the rest I just filled with silicone cuz I think the rubber those rubber bushings were too much so I'm going to just you know plug up the hole and then when you plug these plastic things into it it's gonna create a seal better than that stupid washer they had so let's try this again So don't use rubber bushings. Yeah, that's in now. So once it dries, it'll be good. So now put the 10, 10 millimeter wash uh, bolts back in. And cinch everything down. good so we're gonna I'll give it a little bit see what happens in the future but I think I think we're good if we seal up the those holes with that silicone oh and you want to know what kind of silicone it is it's basic this is what I got Loctite clear RTV silicone all right so it's got an easy squeeze thing. It's got a little. Well, uh, like you give a shit. Nobody cares about that. All right. Uh, and just put your caps back in or yours. Just plug these back in, and we're good to go. That's it. So we'll wait for my wife to. Let me adjust this. And I can talk to you. So we'll wait for my wife. Next time it rains, we'll see if it leaks, and 
see if it works but good luck try this i didn't see any videos on youtube really doing this so i figured let me try because I, I usually do everything myself next i'm gonna be doing gutters on my with the gutter guard so i'm gonna start recording some stuff and putting them on youtube just for everybody everyday guys that just want to get things done themselves all right so good luck thank you and see you later